starts now. Good evening. We begin with frightening video. A crowd ducking for cover after a shooting on the street. And you see a distraught mother carrying her injured child. That six-year-old girl was hit by gunfire. So scary. And a 16-year-old boy was also shot. Let's get right over to local 10 News reporter Terrell Fournay. He is live with a video you saw exclusively. First right here on 10, Terrell. And the youngest victim of this triple shooting, just six years old, she continues to recover here in the hospital. In fact, her grandmother tells me that one of the bullets ruptured an artery when it went through her arm. She, of course, is in a lot of pain, and so is a 13-year-old who is still at the hospital. This, as we hear those 911 calls just coming in, describing a wild and chaotic scene. 911 was here. Just on Gunshots heard in the background of 911 calls as people dashed for cover inside of a corner store. Ten people were shooting. It's so many guns. A woman is seen carrying a six-year-old girl who had just been shot in the arm. And moments later on that surveillance video, police and paramedics arriving to rush that bleeding girl to the hospital. We were there as that injured girl was wheeled into the emergency room. As a family member frantically broke down with blood still stained on her shirt. The shooting happened last night in Fort Lauderdale, just before 10, right outside of Tony's Market, just west of I-95 near Sunrise Boulevard. Several cars were riddled with bullets and ultimately towed away from the scene. Detectives found dozens of shell casings on the ground and believe multiple guns and shooters were responsible for the crime, which also left this 16-year-old boy with a serious gunshot wound. Someone drove him to the hospital. Today, bullet holes that pierce the store are still evident out front. Shattered glass and debris from the shooting itself and from what's being described as a large block party litter the ground near the store. Moments before the gunfire, you see people inside of the store seemingly celebrating with cups in hand. The gunshots were fired shortly after, forcing the life or death dash towards safety. Okay, sir, we have the call in. Oh my God, they're inside the store. Who's inside the, the store? Little baby, little baby. Okay. Send everybody. So wild to listen to, but we also know a third person was shot in that incident, an adult who has since been treated and released from the hospital. Uh, but just to be clear, that 16-year-old boy and that 6-year-old girl, they are both expected to survive this uh, just horrific incident. In the meantime, detectives are still trying to identify the multiple shooters involved in this shooting. Reporting live from Fort Lauderdale, I'm Terrell Fournay, Local 10 News.